Paul's iOS device is a proud supporter of the National Campaign Against Drunk Driving. So my Jeep Compass does not have built-in Bluetooth capabilities, so I cannot make hands-free phone calls or even text via voice assistant such as Siri or Google Now. So I've been looking long and hard to try to find a solution to my problem. What's going on guys? Paul here at Paul's iOS device and thanks to Blue Ant and their fantastic team over there, they sent me a review unit of the Commute. This is a voice activated hands-free car kit. So let's see if this solves my issue. Let's take a look. We're gonna take a look at the Blue Ant Commute's packaging first and we're gonna go ahead and do an unboxing. The Blue Ant Commute is neatly presented and along the front you've got the Commute above the branding, the Blue Ant Commute voice activated hands-free car kit at the bottom. On the left hand side of the package shows you what this all contains. Now I'm gonna crack this open here pretty soon to show you all of these contents. Now on the right hand side shows you the product specs. The talk time is up to 20 hours. That is crazy. That is really nice. The standby time 700 hours. Bluetooth version 2.1, a one year warranty. And now on the back shows you what this Blue Ant can really do. It's truly hands free. You can do more than just talk on the phone like you normally would have to do with a built in Bluetooth in a car. This can do a whole lot more than that. The setup is very easy, which I will show you here pretty soon. And also has Blue Ant's renowned noise, wind, and echo canceling technology to deliver a really clear, high definition sound. So let's go ahead and crack this open. On the left and right hand side, you've got a few stickers that we have to slice. Got the left one done, now the one on the right. And let's see if there are any more. Oh, let's go ahead and pop the top. Unboxings are really interesting. I try to keep the package in as much intact as I can. So now I've got the top open. We're just going to slide the plastic housing out of the sleeve and set that off to the side. Let's prop this up. Now we're going to go ahead and try to pop this Blue Ant Commute out of this plastic box. Just lift up the top lid and you're presented with the Commute. It is attached to this plastic plate. And from first glance, this screen on the Commute does gather a decent amount of dust. But uh, let's go ahead and set that off to the side and get to that later. Let's get to the contents in the box. In the front are the two literature packets. This is the Commute User Guide. This obviously will come in handy when you uh, try to set this device up. I'm going to go ahead and go through some of these steps later on in this video to help make your setup process much easier. So as you can see, you've got different ways to charge the commute. And next, you've got the safety information and warranty terms. Just some more casual reading material. Let's go ahead and pop the box open so we can see the accessories. And what comes in the box is a car charger which is very nice along with here's the uh, the car charger with the USB and here is the micro USB to standard USB cable this is fairly short but you know take what you can get and then next is the clip this is the final accessory in the box let's close this box up and set that off to the side get this out of the way as soon as I clear the box out of the way, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the Commute. Let's take a good tour around this device. The dimensions of the Commute are 2.35 inches wide, 4.87 inches long, and 0.84 inches deep. Now here along the front is the Blue Ant speakers. Along the top you've got your touch sensitive volume controls with the volume down. The command button in the middle and on the upper right hand corner is the volume up 
And below these, you've got little indicator lights. Below the volume down is the battery indicator. Below the command button is a Bluetooth indicator. And below the volume up is the hands-free trigger. Now along the left-hand side of the product, you've got some nice clean lines. There are no buttons on the left-hand side. And again, there are no buttons or microphone or anything at the bottom of the product. Now on the right-hand side, this is where the micro USB and power switch are located. And the micro USB is covered with a nice protective door. It just pops right in. Now along the top, again, keeping a very minimalistic approach to this product, there's nothing at the top other than a microphone. Now that we've taken a quick tour around the product, let's go ahead and set this thing up. Now in the beginning, as it said on the box, the setup is easy. What you need to do is take the commute and turn it on. Right here on the right hand side, flip it on. And now it will communicate with you. Press the answer button now. Select English. Now we need to select the answer button at the top to select our language. And if you select the wrong language, which this has already done, it's in Spanish and I don't speak Spanish. The easy way to go back to English is to take your commute and turn it off and back on. You need to do this before you pair your device. Now back on. Now we can go ahead and select our language. Now locating the Bluetooth area in your settings, the Blue Ant Commute is now pairable and you can select your commute. Another great thing about the commute is that it just pretty much guides you through this whole setup process. Once your device is now paired with your phone, it's going to go ahead and transfer your contacts for you. You can select this blue arrow and you can go ahead and select forget this device if you don't want this device paired with your phone anymore. As soon as your contacts are done transferring over to the commute, you're good to go. Now to manipulate the volume, you can select the minus button or the plus button, volume down, volume down and then plus for volume up. Or you can just slide your finger from minus to plus to increase the volume or from plus to minus to decrease the volume. Now we're going to go over some of the hands-free controls. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Launch voice control. When you say launch voice control, Siri will pop up on an iPhone and Google Now will pop up on an Android device. Doing this gives you a plethora of choices, something that you will not get with a built-in Bluetooth in a car. Now here are a few commands. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Am I connected? Your phone is connected. You can say things like, am I connected? Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Check battery. You can check the battery. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Phone commands. And also by saying phone commands, Siri pops up. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. What can I say? You can say, am I connected? Pair me. Phone commands. Redial. Call back. Check battery. Update phone book. Or cancel. And by say saying, what can I say? The commute tells you the available voice commands. Phone commands. Text my wife. I am testing out. Obviously Siri and Google Now are not perfect, but as you can see, you've got a whole lot of options with Siri and Google Now. Cancel. Okay, I won't send it. With the ability to access Siri and Google Now, the commute is very powerful. You can do a whole lot more with the commute than you could with 
a built-in Bluetooth that comes with your vehicle. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Redial. Redial. You can quickly redial your last contact that you've called. And again, I can't preface this enough. The ability to access Siri and Google Now, you've got a ton, a ton of options you can use. You can find out the score of your favorite team. You can also look up movie times. You've got a ton of options. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Phone commands. What is the weather like today? You can obviously check the weather. Blue Ant, speak to me. Say a command. Phone commands. Remind me to feed the cat when I get home. And quickly and easily set reminders. Here's your reminder for when you get home. So that was my unboxing and review of the Commute from Blue Ant. This is an amazing product. And again, the pluses are that it is very compact, it is portable. So you don't have to just keep it in one vehicle. You can also access Siri and Google Now. That is huge. The only thing that I've noticed that could be improved is the plastic front. It is fairly easily scratchable when you try to clean it off without a microfiber cloth. If you're interested in purchasing the Commute, head over to mybluant.com and I'll have a link to that in the description below. I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, pound that like button down below and pound that subscribe button down below as well. Thanks for watching. This is Paul. God bless.